So I think I will be the first one out of everybody to admit when I am wrong. What's up everybody, Shadow Ninja here, and welcome back to Rage Quit. Happy Martin Luther King Day, and I apologize for my absence during the last course of this week. I was unfortunately having internal hard drive problems on my computer, but everything's all backed up, and uh, I just needed to recreate all my intros and stuff, and that took a little bit of time. But anyways, guys, we are going to get right into the video, and we're going to waste no time because of that uh, slight uh, technical difficulty. But guys, as you all probably know if you're watching this and you are a fan of Mortal Kombat 11 and are playing it, the Joker trailer just released, or a couple days ago released, and it is amazing. Now, when the initial reveal of what all of the Fighter Pack characters in Combat Pack 1 were revealed, I think Joker was my least favorite or least hyped character in my opinion. Because of the fact that we've already seen him in Injustice a couple times, and you know how uh, NetherRealm likes to put their DC characters in Mortal Kombat games and vice versa in their Injustice games. And uh, I think I could speak for myself as well as many other fans that we were not happy with how Joker looked, and we weren't happy with the idea of him being in the game as opposed to someone like uh, maybe say Ash. But um, the trailer released, and we got a really good look of all the stuff that Joker can do, and he looks Fantastic. I understand that due to the backlash that uh, the community gave the uh, developers over how Joker looked initially, he didn't look right. His face was weird, he was a little too buff, and I think the developers actually went in and tweaked his face up and did uh, some more animations, and uh, let's just say that it paid off. It looks really well, and uh, it just looks like Joker from the Injustice games. It sounds like Joker, of course, we have the Injustice voice actor, and that's always cool. His fatality looks so cool, it's so funny, and it is a callback to one of the uh, original game mechanics, the friendship. And uh, on top of this, we are also going to get a couple new character skin packs, uh, and that is, of course, including uh, Katana as Catwoman, uh, Baraka as Killer Croc, and of course, Noob Saibot as the Batman Who Laughs. And I wanted this skin so bad. If it wasn't going to be for Joker, it, it would have been for anybody else in my opinion. I would have just loved to have this skin in the game, come with Joker, and uh, all of the other character skins are very, very well put together and they look awesome. The Killer Croc one especially, you get that Arkham Asylum feel from the old games, and the Batman Who Laughs, my god, I'm probably going to be rocking that all the time as Noob Saibot. That's just one of my favorite Joker variations. And uh, on top of this, his Fatal Blow looks pretty cool too. I mean, it's not really as uh, intense as I would have wanted it, but his other moves definitely make up for that. The way that he moves around, swings his cane, uses some of his abilities from the original Injustice games, uh, you can tell the devs actually went in and took a little bit of the source material from the other games and implemented it into this game, and it's really cool to see the extra attention to detail, the way that he moves around, and it just feels very natural, as I mean all of the characters in this game feel very natural simply because of the fact that it's one of the more realistic renditions of Mortal Kombat to date. And uh, I'm really happy that they got Joker right this time. He looks great, he sounds great, it seems like he plays very well and he's got a couple cool mix-ups and juggles and stuff and all of his abilities and his special moves, they look really cool. And the skins on top of that, I'm very excited to be playing with. Guys, that is going to conclude this Rage Quit video. Thank you all for watching and tuning in to another video. If you did like it, make sure you press the like. And if you're new to the channel and want to stay up to date for more videos such as Mortal Kombat stuff, Star Wars Battlefront 2, For Honor, and much more to come in the future, make sure you press the sub tab and the bell on the side. But guys, I am Shadow Ninja. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you on the next one.